Hi all, welcome to this small video. This is an endeavor by the Cherubushpa Mission League Catholic Suromalbar Eparchy of Great Britain, which explains the beginning, growth, and history of CML, an indigenous pious association for the laity. Dear friends, I hope you are all well. It is very nice to talk to you about Jerobushba Mission League. You may be very well aware of Jerobushba Mission League, or your teacher has been talking about it recently. I am here to give you a brief description about Jerobushba Mission League. It is also known as the CML. CML is the largest missionary organization for laity in Asia. CML was started in Kerala, India, following the independence of India. On 15th August 1947, the government was not in favor of foreign missionary activities by foreigners. Consequently, new missionaries, both priests and sisters, were not welcomed to India. Besides, many foreign missionaries were asked to quit India and return to their homeland. At this point, the Church of India was forced to come to the front front to confront the situation boldly as mark of the prayerful memory of Saint Teresa also known as Little Flower. Mission League started in India, specifically in Kerala, at Parmignanam, on 3rd October 1947. With the blessings of Jignashiri Archbishop, Mar James Karashiri, with the guidance of Father Joseph Muliparamit, the assistant parish priest at Parmignanam, and Mr. P.C. Abraham, popularly known as Gunyadun, took the leading role in institutionalizing Mission League across the state of Kerala. Sema Motto is the prophetic word of His Holiness, Pope Leo XIII, the salvation of India is in her sons. Now, let us think what the aim of this organization is and why we need to join CML. The aim. The Mission League has two definite aims. The first one, fostering mission spirit and assisting missionaries through prayers, contributions and promotion of vocation in accordance with the word of Jesus. Go into all the world and preach the gospel to the all creation. Secondly, personality development. The children will be given opportunities to develop and improve their organizational and leadership skills and qualities. So this is the aim. Now let's look at CML slogan. God's love was an unconditional one, filled with mercy, sacrifice. Jesus Christ set the example of supreme sacrifice. The love to fellow being is tested on the rubbing stone of sacrifice. Service. The call to be a Christian is to serve the community and the society in all possible ways. Suffering. Nowhere do we see him so clearly as on the cross. Nowhere do we see his deity so manifest as on the cross. There is no crown without cross and no gain without pain. The Heavenly Patron for Mission League 
is Saint Teresa of Lisieux. The co-patrons are Saint Francis Xavier, Saint Alphonsa, Saint Thomas the Apostle. CML Commission in Cerro Malabar, a parky of Great Britain, is inaugurated on 3rd October 2020 by blessing of Bishop of the Parky of Great Britain, Mar Joseph Slampical, in guidance, Vicar General, Reverend Father Gino Aricat, by the leadership, CML Chairman, Father Matthew Mulliolin, Membership in the Mission League is limited to Catholics only who have received Holy Communion. In our parky, all Gaddison children who have received Holy Communion and are in classes 5 to 10 are members of our Mission League. As young kids, under the process of faith formation, CML is a perfect platform to practice what they learn in religious classes and so. So I welcome you all to the CML. Thank you.